flower of the week real quick. No. Uh, Jay Kemp, go ahead, go in, man. Man, um, <laughs> I, I'm gonna definitely go into the in a different direction. And it's funny because I, I was gonna go MC Light, but I'm gonna go Ooh. Missy Elliott. And hey, she's still icy too. She's she still is, icy, she dog. Is, you know she what I'm saying? Is, and man. she, I think Missy. she follows on IG. I think she we is. Was... But Miss, Missy is like one of the best artists ever. Yeah, man. Me, regardless ever. of gender, regardless ever. of gender. Ever her, her, her impact, and sing, write, man, come on, dude, man. everything. Ever. Her impact Mass on G-Y. the game <laughs> has just been unbelievable, man. Like, yes, <laughs> the artists that her and Tim pumped out too man. back Woo. there in that time. Oh, I yeah. mean, and just her own body of work speaks for itself. I mean, again, in a versus, who, who's gonna cook Missy Elliott in a versus? Yeah, nah, you you gonna be man or woman. The best chance is maybe Buster. Maybe, maybe Buster. Maybe Buster. Hey man, but she's got hits though. All day hits. Long. She's got hits. Absolute got hits. Heavy, heavy bangers. Features. I mean, yes. she can just go through a list of things she's produced. Mm. <laughs> Nasty. She got, a, she got a producer bag. This, this, this list. Just, oh man, it's out of this world, man. Out, out of this, this world, world yeah. man. And, I, and, I, uh, and let's be clear, she killed that Jodeci, uh Diary of a Mad Ben. That was a lot of her writing on there, man. That I, was. I that she brought that Jodeci back. People man. don't understand her People pen game. Has pen been game. Dumb she's a pen too Griffey, for a long and, and time. We ain't right. talking she's about pen Griffey. <laughs> she's Penny Hardaway. Yeah, <laughs> she's been in her <laughs> Penny Hardaway a long time. But yes. That Penny from Inspector Gadget, dog, with that yeah. computer book, dog. Facts. That Chief Quimby Penny Proud. Penny Proud, too. That Pinstripe Elliot. That's what's up. <laughs> shout out to Missy, but, man. But shout out shout to Missy, out to man. Missy, Missy, yeah. Missy deserves all the flowers. Missy, Miss Demeanor, Elliot. Let's right. get That's serious. Right. Since, yeah, since we yeah, talked about right. one artist from Virginia that we kind of wasn't feeling earlier, <laughs> I had to make sure I show Virginia the proper <laughs> respect. Virginia love, man. Virginia too many love. dope yeah, artists. Yeah, man. He's on a Rico. I don't like that exactly. stuff with the banana exactly. dog pop. I know uh, I don't Vigo like that. mentioned one, two, mad skills. So you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying I had to make sure we we we, we keep the Virginia. Shout out to and, shout out to VA man. Shout yeah. out to the shout out to VA. VA man. The hip hop needed VA man. Hip hop needed VA, VA man. You know yeah, what I'm saying? VA. And hey, speaking of Missy, like Timberland wouldn't be half of who he was without no, Missy either, man. No. Oh, like, absolutely they, not. They did yeah. a lot of collaborations, but a lot of yeah. that hard work was was on Missy's behalf, man. So yeah, man, and that, even on the visual approach, I mean, crazy, I, like y'all said, outside of Busta Rhymes, but, but no, we know no, a lot dude. of folks doing it like that. You know, coming out in that black. You know, trash bag looking thing. I know it wasn't a trash bag. I'm just saying. You know, like, Hype right, Williams yeah, love working, you know what I'm working so, with her and Buster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they, yeah. they oh, came let, with so let's many be serious. Ideas. She was the first one that was that wasn't a you know size four killing numbers, true. man, on a record, true. man. True. You know true. what I'm saying? Yeah, true. She yeah, made yeah. every aunt, and, single auntie out there, man, with the cigarettes and, and, and eating the pickle at the <laughs> gas station with, with finger waves, flip flops on, man. She made them feel with good. She was in finger waves too, man. She was in finger, finger waves boot. with a pickle, dog. You know what I'm saying? She was your aunt and, coming and to the barbecue. Ice and with that one go to, yeah, your aunt showing up with <laughs> yeah. that one go to, <laughs> the finger waves. Right. These for Thanksgiving right. with some stonewashed yeah. jeans. Yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Pop Father, man, who you got for the uh, flowers, Talking about man. your potato salad. She bring the potato salad. <laughs> yeah, all, <laughs> all day. <laughs> Pop Father, oh, you got man. Man. Flowers, man. <laughs> hey man, uh, I, I'm I'm gonna stick to who I said I was gonna do, man. I'm gonna give these flowers to Trick Trick, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Detroit's Trick, Trick, that's man. Detroit's man. very own man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Yo, and, and what's, what's crazy up. about Trick Trick on, is is man. that like. You might not always know his music, but you know his impact on the game. Man. Goon Squad. <laughs> oh, Goon Squad. Almost Goon Squad. You know, more, more than anything, man, the thing that that uh, that I think Trick Trick is most known for is the no fly zone, right? Yep. And yep. a lot of people be critical yeah. of Trick Trick for that no fly zone. But I think they kind of missing the point of what Trick Trick was trying to deliver, man. What he was trying to do. Detroit tell people, versus everybody. Uh, yep. Yeah, yep. that's yep. that's that was the inspiration, to be perfectly yes. honest. Like Detroit, Detroit versus, versus everybody. Not no problem. <laughs> they better they might be they need to be breaking off Trick Trick a little bit of a check. But he was basically saying, like, hey man, 
don't just come over here and think you're gonna fly over Detroit, drop in, get you know five million dollars, and then bounce out. And you just took all the money out of the community and then you flew on to the next place. You know what I'm saying? He was trying to say, I want you to come here. And if you're going to come here, spend some money, build people up, make sure other people get money and that they can do the things that they need to do. Now, he might have handled it in some ways that, you know, everybody might not hey, man. Hey, to build an empire, with. you got to get your hands dirty. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> mm-hmm. you do hey, sometimes. Trick Trick Shout came out, out with trick, that guy. Yeah, he came out with the Godfather three. I think the title somewhat got passed on to L, the Podfather. You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> yeah, and shout man. out to K Slay again. You know, because I believe yeah. uh, Trick Trick was on that Rolling Fifty Deep. That yeah, he was on that Rolling Fifty Deep. Was. Yeah, with, he uh, was. With, and, and Trick Trick with can rhyme though, bro. He, oh, oh yeah, he can. Can. Oh, yeah, he can. You know what I'm saying? And he that's can. the thing. He's Trade the Truth was on there too. Shout out to yeah. Trade the Truth. Trade Trade the truth. Yeah. Shout out right. to Trade the Truth, man. He's been on every. He's been on joints with with Obi Trice, Eminem. You know what I'm saying? Like y'all Shout saying, out to Obi. Real Obi. Nice. Trade the Truth. Uncle Murder. You know yeah. Uncle Murder. Nope. You know what I'm Bishop saying? Bishop Lamont. Dead yep. Sean, Dead Loaf. Like I'm telling you, man. Like he's been out there with Snoop Dogg. All of these cats. You know, everybody Danny in Brown. the game respects this man. And uh, and we need to go ahead and give him his flowers for his impact on the game and making sure that everybody understood how you supposed to do when you step foot in Detroit City. OK, when you Shout step foot in trick, here, trick. you need to understand how you need to operate. And, oh, and you know, your man, he had to find out the hard way, man. Uh, what's what's a little short dude to change up his name? Uh, a l- little young bird, though, you know, got yeah, that little yeah. transformer change. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, man. yeah, man. Young Bird had to learn the hard way. What's his new yeah. name, man? What's his new producer name? Uh, Hitmaker. Yeah, yeah, Hitmaker. Yeah, Hitmaker is a beast. Shout out to Hitmaker, too, man. Uh, hey. The whole squad out there, man. Uh, yeah, he's he's nice. doing good things, man. Yeah, man. Shout so, out to Hitmaker. But, but he understands, and, and he gets it. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of places started to get that and understand that. And I think what you're seeing is is just you're, you're seeing other cities start not to necessarily handle it in the way that he handled it, but to say the same thing. Hey, man, come to my city. But when you come to my city, make sure that you are spending and doing the right things in my city. Uh, you know, and you could even say to a certain extent, uh, a certain extent, that's that's what Jay Prince and them are doing down in Houston as well. He's the you know Jay Prince of Detroit. Oh, facts. One thousand percent there. You know what I'm saying? So and and I think we do need that. You do need to understand, man, that it's about community building and uh, making sure that you build the community. Up facts. So Random that uh, so that we're Guilty all symptoms. winning. Right. Yep. You know what it I'm saying? Yep. We, John P. Yep. <laughs> yeah, man. Album. You're right, Al. Nightmare Absolutely. hooking us up, man. So, yeah, we, we got to give we got to give uh, we got to give our flowers to Trick Trick, man, because he's had such a, a huge impact on everybody. Even even if you don't know, because yeah, he's probably one of your favorite rappers, favorite rappers, favorite rappers he's, man. He's yeah, the guy. way he moves. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, man. So shout he, out to he, Trick He was man. basically Suge that didn't do too much. He, he he did just enough he to make sure enough. you understood. Just enough to make sure you understood. You know what I'm saying? D- and, that, hey, and that's man, what you hey, need to do sometimes. Fresh out. He, he's an official fresh out member. Like real yeah, talk. He's a fifth member. Yeah. Like trick hey, trick. Hey trick, man, trick hey, come, hey, come on anytime, anytime man. You got the mic, You know what I'm saying? All day, Max. man. Mad all respect. Day, every day. Yes. Sir. Uh, right. Hot sauce, man. What you got, man? Well, who's, who's I got, got who's that giving Diablo, the to? I got that fire. Got what you need, man. No, <laughs> <laughs> I got what you need for that late. I mean, uh, <clears throat> um, yeah. So let me get my flowers. Um, I'm gonna kind of mention two entities, so to speak. Okay. Uh, but I'm gonna scale back to the to the one I was initially thinking. Uh, and the first mention I want to make is uh, Diddy's Hit Boy, uh, Hit Boy, Hitman Production Team. Ooh, I wanted to go serious. Yeah. Shout out, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Because obviously they produce monsters. Uh, Man, monsters when it comes to the songs that they've and done. Di- and Diddy would come in and go, ting, 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 ting. Oh, co-production <laughs> credit. Man, Man. hammer, Man. hammer, Stupid. Lord. Yep. You name it, anything, that, pretty much anything bad boy related when it came to Biggie, when it came to Faith, when it came to the, the Loxes, Money, Power, Respect, Mace. Mm-hmm. Diddy, you know, they remind me of that, that DVD that LB told me about about uh Motown's producers that would just do jamming sessions and all that. 
Yeah, yeah man. Yep. Yeah. No, no, seriously. Uh, if you haven't uh, ever seen Standing in the Shadows of Motown, it's a fantastic uh, documentary about all those musicians and how they truly were the impact of what you got out of that Motown sound. Uh, yeah. And if you haven't seen that, man, it'll it'll change how you I need view to check music that out. and stuff. OK, yeah, yeah, called, yeah. This is why you yeah. come to Fresh Out. It's called Standing yeah. in the Shadows of Motown. And, and speaking of uh, the hitman, uh, sh- you know, uh, rest in power to James uh, Untume, the, uh, yeah. the drummer who, uh, who he yeah. was Miles Davis's drummer. Yeah. That kind of put him in a different direction, but he rest was also indeed. who got sampled for that juicy for yep. Biggie. Yep. You yep. know what I'm saying? Yep. This is so, why you come yep. to Fresh Out, son. Yeah, That's man. a good so jewel right there. there. The Great jewel. But yeah, man. The, the, the hitman. Keep going in, Bebo. Yeah, well, there, there's kind of another component to that. And mm-hmm. uh, one of the members uh, from the Hitmen goes mm-hmm. by the name of Yogi. Now, okay. you know, the average audience member might not know who that is, but he was actually in a rap group in the 90s called Crew. C-R-U. Yep. And yeah. Crew was nice. You remember yes. Crew, huh? Yeah, Crew. Yeah, nice, yeah. They, 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 I think they first showed up on what was the R and B? Changing I'm faces. Young, man. I'm young, Changing man. Faces. Yep. Ooh, on that, man. Changing yep. faces. Okay. Yeah, they were on uh, a remix. I think it was uh, we we got it going on, and they were okay. on the yep. remix. It was two cats, or no, three cats. Uh, Yogi was one of them who ended up. You know, once they once Crew broke up, they you know he meaning Yogi went to Hitman, but uh, mm-hmm. the other two was uh, Mighty Ha and. The other one started with a C. Okay. Okay. Chatty. Uh, Chatty. Oh, yeah. The light yeah, yeah. 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 And they had a few singles. I mean, it didn't really, uh, well, they didn't really uh, stick because, again, they they disbanded and, you know, they kind of went their own ways. But they cut a double album when they first they, came out. They had a nice rotation, though, when uh, Yo! On TV Raps was popping. Because I, I remember seeing an interview with uh, Fab Five Freddy. Yeah. He, he, interviewed, he interviewed Crew. Yep, and uh, man, they, they, I mean, they had some bang, they had some bangers, man. They did. They had that pronto. They had uh, just another case. Yep. And uh, what was it? They had and uh, that just Mullen. another case. My Mullen. just another case is probably, I would say, they number one hit. Yeah, I, I agree. I agree. Yeah. It probably was. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna have to get into it, man. I, I'm, I'm mm-hmm. looking them up, man. That mm-hmm. uh, you, that dirty thirty. Yeah, YouTube that was it. Yeah. I'm gonna have to, I'm yeah. gonna check that yep. out. You know, what uh, you, YouTube them, Slim. Because they, 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 they no, some, I will. But this is why you come to Fresh heat. Out, man. To kind of get why some you come stuff, here, some, baby. Yeah, I mean to get the old, the older, bring it into the new. So shout out to Bebo P, man. Yeah, yeah. and the they were signing Def Jam. They, they weren't Rudy Poop, so yeah, no, no, yeah, yeah. They they had they had a deal, deal. They had a deal, deal, deal. And and like I said, they they came out from Jump Street with a double album. So. I mean, they were, you know, they they came with it um, the best way they knew how, I believe, with that Dirty 30. But shout out to crew. Um, like I said, I, I want to keep giving the uh, flowers to cats who are um, seen as forgotten or, you know, on, in the shadow, so to speak. So, you know, this like like y'all said, this is why uh, you folks come to Fresh Out, the new rap city, the world's most dangerous podcast and show. Iceberg Slim. Yeah. You got... Just real quick, oh. man. Uh, I gotta take y'all to South Bronx, the South Bronx. No, all right, um, all right. I gotta take y'all, man, and uh, represent uh, all my Boricuas and all my Puerto <laughs> Ricans, man, with my man Christopher Rios, man. Yeah, big yeah. pun, man. I'm not yeah. playing. I just crush yeah, a lot. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, on baby. If you if you under 35, we Word understand. Play. But Don't you be. gotta go check out Big Pun. He's bigger than the single. Uh, the album, Word man, play. Capital Punishment, man, was so heavy, man. Uh, you got to check that out, man. And then uh, his last album was, uh, yeah, baby. And uh, he, yeah, he, I mean, like the album was just nuts. This is when bars, bars, baby. Man, this you had to bars. have them. You know, you what had man. I want to bust it on me. She want to come up to the like. <laughs> this, this ain't that. This is bars, man. Go back if you like rap. Listen right. to that super, li- that super lyrical, that, that uh, super lyrical joint yeah, with Black man, Thought. Like, yeah, man. Oh. I mean, this is when Classic I first dude. met Jay Kemp and Bebo, man, and I was, 
you know, first the, the the albums, man, were when I was just learning hip hop and not only listening to it but crafting it. And mm -hmm. uh, Big Pun was like a really, you know, intricate part of that, man. And like I said, yeah. then the other side of that too is, you know, he passed away because of his health. Yep. And you know, he was just getting right, man. He was just getting his money right. He was doing his mm -hmm. thing, mm -hmm. and um, like I said, man, you know, I mean, he was doing a song with, with Jennifer Lopez, which was. She was one of the biggest artists at the time. So at the end mm -hmm. of the day, man, you know, your health is important, man. Again, treat your health just like your hustle, man. And absolutely don't ever put that to the side, man, because you're trying to take care of the fam. And I know for men, we're always supposed to be superheroes. We can never cry. We can never, you know, show a moment of weakness, man. But take some time out to take care of yourself. Get some rest, man, and do your thing. Because at the end of the day, you can't help your family when you're six feet under. So okay. again out the bars man stream these cats man help out p rock man get that get that money you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. stream p mm -hmm. rock man uh uh big pun missy uh trick tricks uh uh body of work man and yeah, also a uh, crew man crew. check out these yep. cats man and, and take yeah. some time to hear what they was talking about man because if you spend too much time listening to this music now <laughs> you gonna have some problems you'll talk yeah, man. man yeah you, you'll be sideways you be, be on pills <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, man. Uh, you know, it, it, if I could add on to that one, man, Pun uh -huh. Uh -huh. is right up there with the Biggie and Pox. I mean, he's oh, right up yes. there. Yeah, one play was so let's not get dumb. it twisted. And Big yeah, L was it se he seemed like he was on his way. Yeah, that, yeah man. You know what I'm saying? But obviously, he got taken out early. You know earlier yeah. than what he should have and it's a and it's a lot of supreme lyricists when they when they name they top five they top ten pun yes. being they top ten oh you oh, have yeah. to top five yeah, yeah. i mean, I mean yeah. when, when you got bought what's the, the respect that he had was ridiculous man, man. yeah man. dead in the middle of little literally diddle yeah hold on <laughs> dead in the middle of little little italy little did we know that we riddled some middlemen who didn't do diddly and then fat joe yeah. come it'll yeah, be man. a cold day in hell when i take an yeah. l Make no mistake hey. for real when I hesitate to kill. Hey man, Jay, Listen, they had Jay Z man. shook, man. When when they were dropping, Jay Z oh, was facts. shook. Man. Facts, Jay Z was man. shook, man. Because facts, man. if Pun would have lived, hey. it would have been a problem. It would have been, been a problem, man.